What's up? This is Aoi Sip. Now, if you're new to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and the bell icon para naman updated ka sa mga susunod ko pa videos. No? So, let's start. Finding the area in shaded region. So, bago natin alamin yan, kailangan mo na meron kayong background about finding the area of geometric figures. No? Sa of some geometric figures. Like the rectangle, no? yung formula niya, and then square, a circle, and then the triangle. No? So, yan yung mga gagamitin natin muna sa, dito sa ating video na to. So, for example, we have the rectangle no, na nasa loob niya ang square. So, yun. So, may kita natin dito, no? Nasa loob yung square. So, kailangan alamin mo yung mga formula niya. No? So, so, kung ang, ang length natin is 20, and then the width is 10, and then yung sa square natin, ang measure ng side is 4, so, you're, we are going to find the shaded region. Ito yung shaded region niya. So, kung ito yung kanyang shaded region, no? so, meron tayong formula para makuha. Yan, no? So, the formula is the area of the shaded region, nakalagay dito, equals the area of the larger figure, o yung shape, yung pinakamalaki. Ima-minus natin sa smaller, no? sa mas maliit na figure. So, ito ang kanyang magiging formula. So, equals no? Equals yan ng the area of the larger is the rectangle, di ba? So, yan ay length times the width minus the S squared which is the over square. So, length times width so, 10, uh, 12 multiply natin sa 10 minus the S is 4 squared. So, ito ay magiging 1 20 minus 16 So, 120 minus 16 is 104 centimeter squared kung centimeter yung kanyang unit. So, o kaya, pwede lang sabihin the area of a shaded region is equivalent to 104 square unit. So, for example, number 2. No? So, we have a circle tapos pinakatungan niya yung square. No? So, may kita natin dito. So, sa circle, no, ang radius ng circle is 6. May kita dito ng 6. And then, yung square, no, square natin is uh, ang side, no, ang measure ng side is 20. Again, no, what is our formula? We're going to find the shaded region, ito yung shaded region, and then the formula will be the area of the shaded region equals the area of the larger figure minus the small figure, no? So, equals yan, no? Now, ano ba yung large figure, no? Yan ay square. So, ang formula ng getting yung square is S squared minus D circle, which is the pi R squared, which is the R is our radius. So, S, which is our uh, 20 squared minus pi, R natin is 6 squared. So, 20 is 400. Yeah, 20 squared is 400 minus 5. Pi, 6 natin is 36. 6 squared is 36. So, ito ay merong 400 minus 36 pi. So, the area of shaded region natin, ito, no? Pero pwede rin natin siyang i-translate or going decimal, no? So, decimal na value, no? So, ang area of shaded region ay magiging 286.90. So, let's go to example number 3. For example number 3, no? So, meron naman tayo dito ang dalawang circles. So, mali, isang alam, no? So, Ang isang circle, no, yung pinakamalit, ang radius niya, no, may radius siya ang 4, no? And then, sa malaki naman, may kita natin dito, no? Ang radius niya is 9. So, ngayon, ulit, formula natin ito, no? So, equals to sa area ng big larger, which is pi 
r squared minus d pi r squared. Parehas lang sila, no? So, yung malaki is yung radius niya ay 9 squared minus yung radius naman ng maliit is sorry, 4 na. So, 4 yung kanyang radius pala. So, then 4 ang kanyang radius. So, 4 squared to. So, 5 9 is 81 minus ng gawin decimal no so ang kanyang value sa decimal no which is 204.20 square unit so let's go to example number 4 example number 4 naman no ang bigger figure is circle again no and then yung smaller is triangle so alamin dapat natin yung mga formula ng kanilang pagkuha ng area so again no, formula, area, shady division is given into the larger area minus the smaller. And then, ano ba yung large natin? Area, which is the pi r squared. No? Ikita natin dito sa pinggan natin. And then, dahil dyan sa pinggan na yan, no? ang kanyang, ang kanyang radius, no, na naging legs ng triangle, no, ay 6. No, so 6 yan. So, range niya 6. Sa taas din ito. 6 din. So, pi r squared minus ang area ng triangle is 1 half base times the height. So, ang pi r squared is pi. Ang r niya is 6 squared minus the 1 half of base. What is base? Is 6. Ganun din yung kanyang height. No? 6 din ang kanyang height. So, magiging pi we have 6, no? Minus 1 half now 36. So, this will become 36 pi minus 1 half ng 36 is 18.